Now that Series 9 is here, we have a new wave of Apple Watch bands. Today, we're looking at all the Nike Sport Bands and Sport Loops. So you see if it works for you or not, or you're just like me and can't get enough of Apple Watch. I'll be showing them in different angles and lighting, so you get a better idea of it in real life. Feel free to comment below and let us know what you think of these new watch bands. If this helps, give it a like and subscribe for more. Starting with Sport Loops. Let's look at the Sequoia Orange Nike Sport Loop. Finally, we get slightly new packaging. These QR codes with the recommended watch faces are exclusive to the Nike watch bands. I mean, you can make the watch face yourself with the latest software, but why not take a shortcut? Go ahead, go back, pause, and scan it. As you see here, unlike the normal sport loops, we have new elements to the sport loop design. Even the Velcro on the inside. It seems like this one has all the earth tones with orange accents and a foundation of green. I love how they have the logo now. I hope they keep it. If you're wondering how it feels, it's still that soft sport loop that we know and love. Still a light and breathable material. My favorite pairing has to be with the gold stainless steel Apple Watch. It brings out all the warm colors in the band. Which should look good on all the watch colors, I just don't have red to test it out. You'll see different color watch cases throughout the video and you will notice I love my stainless steel. Here it is in warmer light. Definitely Sequoia National Park vibes. Apple hinting the next Mac OS perhaps? And now for the bold. Bright green and blue. Closest thing to neon in a good minute. You know what to do. Actually more vibrant in cooler lighting. And warm lighting seems to bring out the subtle yellow that makes it green. Milky. I personally think Apple and or Nike are playing it safe with the color naming lately. I mean this blue isn't close to the primary color we know. It's more in the family of navy. Both companies are usually more creative. Especially Nike playing it safe with their styles this year. I love them too, but don't even get me started. These sport loops though, I'd say it's one of the good ones. You know you love these details. Don't worry, I am getting my workout in, just modeling for you guys in between sets. If anything, it does push me to do another set. The lightest of them all, Starlight in Pink Nike Sport Loop. You know this is made for the new pink Apple Watch and Starlight of course. A little more subtle in the details for those who like it. Definitely a softer option visually. I wonder how cool it would look with the darker pink as the top stitching instead of the light peachy looking pink. You know, add some contrast. But hey, that's just me. Game Royale and Orange. It's cool. 
It's the only one that takes advantage of that logo piece to make an accent. Also the only one I wonder if I said the name right. These are real Nike colors though. Like there are Nike shoes with the exact same color. Here it is in warmer light. You can probably tell by now the colors show in every lighting, even from far away. Next up, black and blue. It's kind of like how it sounds, but generally more black. I like how the blue looks kind of metallic with the material. Again, not the bluest blue, but it does match the blue titanium iPhone exactly. Of course we'll see the blue better in cooler lighting. Definitely made for the midnight color Apple Watch. Here I'm pairing it with Space Black. That way you see how it blends in with dark Apple Watches. Alright, time for the sport bands. Cargo Khaki is up first. Go for it. What do you think of the new double pull tab thing? I think I just like ripping it off in one motion, but whatever. I love how unique this screen is. Those little sprinkles of darker repurposed sport bands actually gives it additional depth and this style a little more subtle compared to the others, but tastefully done with a hint of blue. Again. I've really been enjoying this with the gold. Superbly complements the band. Take a look. I'm glad Apple didn't go crazy with the flakes because this one's all about the color. Still feels very light and comfortable on the wrist. You'd think it would feel cheaper with the repurposed material, but it actually still feels like good quality. One of my top favorites out of all these. The Midnight Sky Sport Band. The little flakes on it make it look more like granite than a uh, night sky. Would love to see this on the graphite Apple Watch. Surprisingly, compliments gold. I think it's the color and the perforations. From far away, of course, it looks more like gray or black.
Also looks like the secondary grayish color could match the clay iPhone case. It's interesting how you can kind of feel the flakes. I mean, wearing it, you can't feel it at all. But when you rub your hand against the edges, I don't know why you would, but just to feel it out, you can feel a little bit of micro texture. It's just interesting. Like you can actually feel that it's made from repurposed material. Again, on the wrist, it still feels like that Nike sport band we know and love. Magic Ember is back. All speckly and stuff. Scan this QR code to get the matching watch face. I think I've got it down this time. All right, six out of seven. This band though, 10 out of 10. I mean, the recycled band particles look real good on it. Other than that detail, everything else looks the same since 2021. I see why they brought it back though. So if you missed it last time, now's your second chance. It's a keeper for sure. Desert Stone. It's a warmer off-white with, with some kind of greenish gray in the perforations. With multicolored speckles that you can appreciate up close. Reminds me of my old spruce gray sport band. Look good with practically anything. Check it out. Here it is outside. Pure Platinum also makes a comeback. With the slightest shaded white and an even whiter perforation. The difference, as you may have guessed, is the speckles. More like multicolor confetti the more closer you get, but honestly hard to notice from afar. So you get light birthday party vibes up close, and slightly ceramic from a distance. Take a look. some outdoor lighting. Love the Nike Bands this season. The last one here, the Blue Flame Nike Sport Band. It's like the sibling of Game Royal from earlier, but with more of a pop. Although nothing like a burning Blue Flame 
its secondary color makes up for it and its proud display of orange contrast beautifully here it is in this shade i honestly thought i would like this the most but somehow it gives me a visual illusion that makes it look way more skinnier than the watch than it proportionally should look like a pencil neck effect darker to mid-tone colors seem to help with this like my series 5 gold apple watch i've been wearing which is more like copper blending it together more. Wow, this is a good wave of Nike watch bands. So far it could be my favorite thus far. The sport bands are way better in person and the sport loops are the most detailed yet. What do you think of them? Comment below. I hope this helped. If so, give it a like and subscribe for more. Support the channel and check out the latest sponsor in the description or click somewhere around here. Thanks for your support and thanks for watching.